Hey there, everybody. Thomas Wood with ValueCharts.com. Today we're going to take a look at gold. It is Tuesday, December 30th, and uh, last day of the trading room before January next week. So, say we had several really good trades, lots of great opportunities in several different markets. But one of the ones I want to point out was gold, uh, the long trade we had in gold. Now, if you were in the trading room yesterday, you know we were selling gold in the breakdown of support right here. Uh, right there, we were selling gold in the break of support with a target of significantly undervalued, which is right there. And um, that was because it was coming off of support coming down from this trend line that goes all the way back to December 10th. Well, you can see today, uh, gold rallied up and it broke the trend line. While we were in the trade room, we sat there and watched it go up. We watched it break through. We said, okay, now is when you're buying. It should continue to go higher. And again, the target was significantly overvalued, which is right up here in the upper red price bar segment. So you were getting long from around 93.50 or so. And uh, the target was up here around 1205 so not a bad trade, about $1,200 a contract uh, worth of a move. And it really, honestly, it only took a few minutes for it to happen, or for the majority of it to happen. You put a break, you know, stop in place, and it continued to rally. So either way, it worked out really well, played out just like we thought it would. Again, gold's a great market to use trend lines for. Uh, these trend lines work really well for gold. It's notorious for breaking trend lines and running, just like this. So that's all I have for you for today. Hope everyone has a great New Year's. Again, the trading rooms are closed until January 5th, I believe, which is next Monday. So again, have a great New Year. And until next time, happy trading.